In this video, I'm going to tell you about the monthly expenses incurred as an international student in Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia. So uh, I must tell you that this, the cost I'm going to tell you is for a budget living. Like if you want to spend more, there's no limit. And if you want to save more, like if you cook completely for yourself, then you can save more. All right, so let's start the video. What's up, guys? My name is Abdul Moiz and I'm an international student in Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia. So uh, don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet. So uh, let's start the video. First thing about your monthly expense is going to be your rent. If your rent, my rent is basically 650. So if your rent is around 600 or 650, including your utilities, that's going to be your first expense. So after that, we have food and groceries. It include the groceries also includes your toiletries like uh, your shampoo, your conditioners, and all that stuff, your soap and all, everything. Also for some uh, some stuff like you can say uh, for what you need at home like uh, tissue paper and all those things. So. Uh, for groceries, it's going to be costing you around 300 and 350. So that's just the groceries and all that stuff. If you, uh, but that's not all the meal you're going to eat. Like, uh, let's say university sometimes. So that's going to be around 150. So let's say that your food and your groceries, including everything, it would be around 500 ringgits. So 500 ringgits that for that and 650 for the rent. It's it is around 1150 but that's not all so after this you need your sim package uh, i have u35 mostly students in here use u35 uh, or just any other uh, mobile carrier doesn't matter but uh, the 35 ringgit package i let's say in once a month you go to bagit bentang and that area and you want to eat at a good restaurant or cuisine so that's going to cost, cost you around 50 to 70 ringgits per one trip so let's say you keep uh, 150 for these things so it's going to be around uh, 1300 ringgits now be sure like uh, this is not the actual cost all right sometimes it's going to be more sometimes it's going to be less like like uh, let's say one month you cook more and you spend less at uh, outings and gatherings you have uh, more studies and you're cooking for yourself more so it's going to be less around you can say 1100 and let's say if you're having vacations and you're going for some outdoor activities you can spend more as well like it can go up to 1400 or 1500 ringgits or it can also come less if you cook completely for yourself around the 1000 ringgits and if you spend more or if your rent is more like you live in a master room or medium room then it's going to be around uh, minimum 1500 up to 2000 so uh, this is basically all right, so these were the expenses. Now I'm gonna give you some tips on how to save more money, all right, and spend less. So first things first, don't use Grab. Make sure that you use as less Grab as you can because Grab costs too much. And if you are using Grab, make sure that you go with your friends so that you can share the Grab brand. Like uh, when I go to groceries, I get my friends along with me and they also want to get groceries when they also want to get groceries, right? So that, uh, and we go in the morning, always book Grab in the morning around uh, 12 or 1 so that uh, by the time we come back it's going to be around the 4 or 5 because after 5 or maybe including 5 as well grab is uh, almost double and triple the rates so let's say in the morning if it's around uh, 8 ringgit so in the evening it's going to be around uh, you can say 20 or maybe 25 ringgit so that's too much right so that's the first thing uh, the next the next thing is make sure that your rent is low like spend good time and good effort on getting a good place uh, where you can live the utilities and everything should be very nice the facilities should be good but also your rent should be as minimal as it can if you have not seen my apartment yet make sure i'm gonna uh, drop the link in description make sure you check that video as well all right and if you cannot find a good accommodation for a low price uh, make sure you hit me up i'm going to help you find a place if as since you're a student here in malaysia so get a uh, letter from your university uh, in apu we can get it in app space online if you don't know how to get it you should uh, go to app space and then your uh, e forms e letters in the more option and then you have the reference letters so in that you uh, like uh, type MRT or LRT you can get a reference letter then you apply online to LRT services and for which you get a student card of LRT that will give you 50% discount on every trip so that is very nice like to so make sure you get that as well because you're gonna be using LRT here very much so uh, grab LRT and uh, then we have the less strength after that uh, make sure that try to cook more as you can like uh, make sure that Every day you cook your breakfast yourself because making eggs is not that difficult. 
All right, I make eggs and uh, omelet and half rice, and they are, these are very easy. Like if you want to get the uh, like a meal from your, your university or from outside or in your restaurant, local cuisine or something, make sure it's your dinner, not your uh, breakfast. All right, and try to eat less outside and more from your own cooking so that is going to be very much cheaper like uh, you can also get ready to eat items like uh, you can fry some things you can get the chicken i am goreng is called in here i am goreng is basically i am is chicken in malay so uh, i am goreng is fried chicken you can get it from any grocery stores if you want to check the grocery, uh, grocery prices i'm going to put a link in the description you can check that as well if you want to live in park hill aeon is the closest one here so it is very convenient to go there it's a bit expensive than others like uh, mines and others but it's reasonable it's not that much if you want don't want to use grab and if you want fewer things if you want more things then definitely you should go to lotus or nsk or something all right so that's it for today guys i'm getting late for my university that's why i'm dressed up so uh take care Allah office we'll meet you in the next video make sure you subscribe my channel